Now this is a story all about how my life got flipped, turned upside down, and I'd like to take a minute to sit with them. I'll tell you how I became the winter with Town Hall of Salem. Our story begins on a distant island in the Caribbean. On the island of Barbados, born and raised in the villages where I spent most of my days Chilling out, maxing, relaxing, all cool, and all doing some voodoo after the school. And this one merchant guy who was selling some goods bought me up and took me from the neighborhood. I did real hard work and he wanted me with him. He said, You're going with me to a town called Taylor. Today, we will be telling the story of Tichuba, a woman from Barbados who was sold into slavery to a merchant by the name of Samuel Paris. He puts her on a boat and brings her to a small province in Massachusetts called Salem. I cursed and I chanted with her day after day, and then ever drank blood, mercy threw her clothes away. The frog got a kiss, and then we saw my dead kids. I put the frog in the pot and said, yo, let's start this. In Salem, Tichuba has become a slave to the recently elected Reverend Paris. After getting to know the family and the people in the village, she began to tell the young girls stories of her culture. One day, the girls finally convinced Tichiba to perform black magic in the woods. They danced and she chanted as their desires were heard. Abigail Williams drank chicken blood and Mercy Lewis took off her clothes. As everything was happening, Paris found them and they all ran. I had to lie about it almost every day, but it was kind of fun. I got to practice my old ways. I got to tell stories in full Reverend Hale, but I thought this is bad. I'm feeling the jail. Betty, the daughter of Paris, has suddenly fallen ill. Abigail Williams, the niece of Paris, admits that they were dancing in the woods with Tichuba to her uncle. In a panic, Reverend Hale, an expert on witchcraft, is called to come aid the afflicted. They go to question Tichuba and all hell breaks loose. She made me do it! Tichuba no do bad thing. Tichuba a good Christian woman. Tell us or you die! Okay, I tell you! I said what I was and they threw me away. And I yelled to the Reverend, this isn't the way. I looked at my kingdom, I was finally with them. To sit on my throne as the witch of Salem. Tichuba confessed to being a witch so she could keep her life. Abigail and the other girls accuse many other people in the village of being witches. While in jail, Tichuba and Sarah Good, another woman who confessed, began to believe the lies that were being said. They were waiting for the devil to take them. We go into Barbados. So the devil gets here with the feathers on the wings. He frees his soul in Massachusetts, but in Barbados, he just is sweet and... <laughs> Oh, devil, take me home. Devil cow, come save me. This is only Tichuba's part of a larger story. This kind and caring woman was forced to lie to avoid death. The differences in her culture almost caused her to lose her life. 